Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to a uh, hardcore YouTube Space Engineer Survival Series. Uh, I'm starting on the whole uh, desert planet, so that by itself is going to be the main problem. Uh, I have never actually done the desert planet, so I'm excited about this. I know that the devs made this primarily for like a rover. Uh, but the goal is obviously to get off the planet, and I think this would be a nice challenge to do that. Um, I don't know how scarce water is going to be. I don't know how rare research is going to be. Obviously, I'm looking at iron and nickel here, just within 300 meters of my landing spot. But um, I tell you what I did do. I, I went around the planet and I saw some like really bright green places, and. Um, so I'm guessing that's water, so I think I, I don't know, I have to go and find that water supply. I see it affects the star. Um, hmm. Goal for this world, honestly, so Smokey has his, you know, survival world thing, and uh, I was really enjoying playing that, but, you know, I want to play more than he's playing right now, and that's perfectly fine. Um. So, I decided to do my own. It's nothing special. Uh, it is uh, heavily modded, but there's nothing like... Um, there is real no theme here except me just wanting to get off this planet. Uh, I will do any type of RP if there's anything that um, I find interesting. Uh, I'm hoping that maybe some of my friends will show up and we can do something together. I do have plans on buildings. I am, I've had a lot of time wanting to play this game, so I spent a lot of time building, uh, like, you know, just building in <laughs> creative mode. So I have a, a, new, a new ship I want to put into the world. I have a new base I want to put into the world. I have uh, the Prometheus, obviously, that I want in here. I have a lot of stuff going on. Uh, when I was looking around for uh, water spots, I did notice that ravines and places was a good place for them. So I'm gonna go around the ravines a bit until I find it. That's what that's what my goal is here. Um, actually, this is a green spot. What if there's ice here? No, there's iron. Lots of resources here. Pretty deep down. Should be should be fine. Uh, but yeah, that's, that's basically it. Um, when it comes to the frequency of how, uh, you know, like episodes coming out, I'm guessing maybe two, two episodes a month. Uh, reason why they're so spread apart is if you have to think about it as a 30 minute episode would most likely take me, you know, five hours of gameplay. Like right now I have to go find ice. There's no telling how long it's going to take me. And, um... Then, you know, me building a base. I might can do time-lapse, maybe. Even that would be kind of hard. I can do time-lapse with Bob building it. Um, so, yeah, it's, it's all that. It's all the nitty-gritty stuff of space engineers that, you know, you guys don't want to see. Um, and I find fun because I can, you know, I can watch the, my favorite TV show. And it's great. Did I exit this ravine already? Looks like it continues. Anyway, so I'm going to drive around until I can find some ice, and uh, and we'll start seeing about um, building a base and getting things sorted. Honestly, the only reason why I'm prioritizing ice, I don't, I guess I don't really need ice except for hydrogen. Yeah, I need ice for hydrogen. That's that's a good reason. So yeah, ice is a useful resource to have. So I'll be back when I have found uh, ice. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and uh, here I am. Uh, I did find ice, and uh, as you can see, I have been pretty busy. Uh, I've been off and on during all day. This is maybe three and a half, four hours of stuff. Um, it is nighttime. Uh, I have a time lapse of this being built. I will put that at the end of the episode. Uh, I know that this isn't a lot, but this was a, a lot of work. This is about um, 6,000 steel plates. 
Uh, we have this going up. We've got our advanced uh, wind turbine, a simple one. We're doing a similar refinery, a carbon container, and a projector, and a uh, building repair system. Uh, should be good. I have that building repair system prioritizing uh, blocks. Eventually, this is... Uh, I'm thinking whether or not I should project the whole thing. You know what? I'll leave that be a mystery. If you don't know what this is, you know, leave leave in the description what, if you know what this is. Because I don't know if this has ever been in the channel. This is a build of mine, and uh, you'll just have to see what it is when it's finished. Um, so, uh, I started to, so I've been mining iron with this, this drill. And been taking it, and that's how I built that. But that's not very efficient. So I started to mine. I wanted to mine with big drill, and that didn't work well because two pistons, uh, two hinges, and a piston do not work together. So I'm gonna gonna have to restart that. I'm actually put a small car container right there to make it better. Um, but I did drill a little hole here to just see how it thinks the iron is so having this piston go up and down should should be enough just point it towards that way and do it so uh if you want let's we can do that together and get this broke down and uh next episode uh, next episode is going to be, I think, getting upgraded tools, uh, getting more iron, uh, to finish off that building. This is going to be that Also, our go antenna. I want the small one. Let's move on over here. The reason why there's two overs is because, um, I've had one of my friends uh, come over. Uh, Nick. Nick's joined me for this. So you will see him around. Okay. I still can't place this because I need an interior place which I can't carry because I am fully owning. Duction. Going to your place. You made it to your place. There you go. I can carry nine. Let's go here. I kind of want to that walk spot. Doink, 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 doink. Nine. That there. And then. Put a hinge. We want up and down. Put that there. Perfection. Then piston so that we can do length. I already had one there. Uh, yeah. Should have everything I need to build it. Go, 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 go. Should have a place down this down, maybe. Yes. I doubt I'm going to be able to place it though so what I need to do is go to this hinge and have the lower limit okay have the upper limit there it is That should be enough. Let me just stand on here. Weld this up.
I am obviously going to need to mine a little bit of this. It's not rock not. I can left click that. That should be enough. <clears throat> That's a weird book. Okay, stop sliding downhill, please. Okay, uh, da -da -da. drill on. Hinge. We do want the lower limit. Okay, so right now it's at 18 degrees. So if I reverse, it won't go anywhere. This is work. Oh, there you go. Oh my. Okay. You gotta be gentle with the hinge. Gentle with the hinge. But that should be collecting. Look at all that. Theoretically, should be going into the cargo container that does not exist. Right. It probably won't be able to make it since we were out of iron. Nope. Oh, okay. Fuel. Hello. Ow. Fuel critical. And yes, the name of the world is called YouTube World because that is what this is. It is a YouTube world. What's the plan? I'm standing on this little display. How do you do? It's a message. I think it's time to extend the piston. Very slowly. Piston velocity. That's nice. Uh, eventually, I think the next step, which is I'm going to have to design it, is going to be a little uh, transport ship. Something that I can use. To, like collect this stuff because I don't want it all to be one grid and now I have big plans for that building that building is going to have underground tunnels going to a lot of places like on top of that plateau I have an idea um, I have a lot of stuff over here which while this is extending it was actually extended yes it's actually extended out maximum so let's piston reverse up this reverse to fifty thousand. I think that's a good spot. Uh, let's go ahead and turn the drill off. And let's go over here. And I want to show you some expansion plans that I have. Uh, when it comes to mining resources. I see there's a lot of resources in this area. There's a lot. But the next place I want to build to collect resources is going to be uh, a little bit further down this ravine here. And uh, there is nickel, silver, iron. Um, so there's nickel, gold, iron, and silver. I want to do a quick little stop here to show you the perfect drill hole. Then with the hand drill, I needed some nickel, and that was just an amazing little hole there. I like that. Um, I love little lower tracks. And this is going to be our boundary of our uh, where we own. 
right here. I'm eventually going to build that. And if I come up the hill, up here is where there's iron and uh, silver. Well, actually, I think it's just iron. Oh, there's silicon here too. See, there's everything right here. And there's the silver, there's the silicon, there's the iron. So let me put this on the park. You'll notice that this is, you know, a rich mountain that, you know, I want to do a lot with and uh, make into some type of defensive thing. Let's go ahead and turn around. Sorry, I'm not talking, I'm concentrating. There we go. I looked out a bit that way, there's not much going on. So let's go back uh, to the base and I think uh, call this an episode. I think this should be about a 30 minute episode. Again, uh, once we get back to the base, um, uh, I'll explain a little bit about what's going to go on next episode and uh, in the time lapse of what I was able to build, we'll start. It's not going to be a very big one. Actually, I was able to build a whole lot, but it should be fun. Um, happy I got that drill up and running. I doubt now just need to transfer it all, whether it's manually this time. Um, this drill can hold, I think, 30,000, so two chips with this rover should do it. Eventually, I will build a small grid. Um, I think I'm going to limit that. I think I'm going to limit rovers to small grid, so I can only build small grid uh, ground vehicles. Which I think I have to anyway, because not I don't think a large grid will fit through the thing. So, um, and I have plans to build a garage, which a large grid won't work. So, small grid rovers. Uh, making that a rule. I'm happy this works. And I didn't want to build a whole space here, because um, there's not enough iron for that. And the reason why I wanted two hinges was so I can kind of go back and forth. So, the next hinge I will make is going to be the one that goes back and forth. Which... It'll go straight, so I'll have to build it here, and then that'll work. Anyway, so I hope you enjoy the time lapse, and I hope you have a wonderful day. And with that, Robert Real, the Space Engineer's uh, Desert Survival. Uh, this episode was alone, next will not be, is uh, signing off. Enjoy the time lapse.